Hey everyone, it's Gretchen here. Um, happy mail, happy mail from Amelia. That girl spoils me so much. So look at this pretty pink box. How cute. Let's get right into it. Um, I just cut it open, I haven't looked. It comes with tissue paper on the top and There is what's inside. Oh my goodness. So first up, I see a box. It says, these are the good bags I buy from ShopRite. She had sent me Happy Mail a couple months back. And the bags in there, that I still had one over there, just sounded, I uh, loved it. So these are unbleached, totally chlorine free, paper, snack, and sandwich bags. And you know what? I have to tell you, Amelia, I went to ShopRite and I had no luck. I walked around and I wonder where the aluminum foil and everything was. So I'm tickled pink, tickled pink that you sent these. And I just got to show you, there's Luna. Just got to show you uh, what one of these look like and what they sound like. That's unique how they come packaged. Can you hear that? Oh my goodness, love it. Let's keep that one out. There's 48 bags in a box. Thank you so much for these. She sent me a notebook. And I just gotta check to see what it looks like inside. Oh, and there's the card. I was rude. I should look for the card first. I just, Luna, I get so excited. I just want to start digging in. And there's a card. Cute. She just says, goes on to say, so happy you're feeling better. She thought she sent some vintage goodies and my favorite bags. Yes, love those. Thank you for all your videos. I love them all. Ollie's Craft With Me Cooking, of course, your journals too. And of course, Chloe, have a great weekend. I love Amelia. Oh, thank you so much. That's so sweet. You did not have to do this. Um, my heart is overwhelmed. And, but as I'm looking down, I see a wax scent shot by Front Porch Candles, blueberry bread pudding. And I had no idea Front Porch started doing the little plastic containers. I wonder if that's something new. Oh, wow. You know what this smells like? I just finished up the hand soap by Bath and Body Works in blueberry crumble. And it's just very, very similar to that. Now I'm gonna have to go back on the website and look. It's been a while since I ordered from them. Um, you know, I always get pretty good throw from their, their stuff. The only thing I don't really like is like the strawberry scents. They seem to be a little synthetic, but my opinion. And then Bonjour Gooey Toasted Marshmallow. What the fluff? Oh, nice. Oh, wow. And that really smells good. Good. Do they use a, I wonder if they use a, can you see the sparkles? A palm, a palm uh, wax. Wow. I don't know much about this company. I've never ordered from them. But if that smells anything like it does on cold, it seems like they'll be worth the money. Some trivia cards. Baby boomers. There goes Luna. I'll try to cut some of her out hacking. Uh, another regular day, you know, hanging around the house. So the trivia card. Thank you for those. Lots I can alter. I also see peeking at me some um, the, the bridge cards. I recognize these. <laughs> yes, 
You just recently bought a set like this. I found this meat and split it with you. Oh, I found this one and split it with you. Well, thank you so much. Oh, you're so thoughtful. And it's the bridge tally card, which I still want to try to tea dye these because I think they'd make wonderful tea dyed papers. The paper sound, the thickness seems just about right. Much like copier paper. And then the cards, and I just recently discovered these. I had a couple of these that I bought once upon a time, but I never knew you could get cards that are so pretty on the front. And they're just cards on the back. And I think these are pretty much ready to go. Just put one in the uh, pocket and let the recipient, you know, um, they could do whatever they want with it. That's so sweet. <laughs> For your rings or whatever on your desk. Pier one. Oh, it's a ring. You know, and I do not own one of these. I do not hold, I do not have one of these little trinket ring holder, uh, or not, whatever, you know, jewelry trays. And I've been, it's funny, I was thinking to myself, I really need to get a trinket tray so I could put my, with, with the surgery, I just put my rings in the bathroom. And then I'm like, well, I don't want them to fall into the sink. So then I moved them down to a drawer and I had to remember where they were at. And this, is wonderful. You must have, um, you must have knew I needed one. So that will go to put my rings on. I recognize these too. She got me some of the seed envelopes from Target. They are a very in demand crafty item right now. The seed packets. Thank you so much. And then more vintage goodies. You did not have to. How do you find this stuff? I, get, I just don't have much luck. Maybe yard sales, but I haven't done a yard sale since the end of, hmm, probably August of last year. It was the last time I went out. And I didn't really, I mean, I saw like a couple cookbooks, but that was it and I didn't pick them up. And the lady was pushing on, on like hard, like take them, take them. But they were big and bulky and I just didn't want to have to try to fill them up, you know, like store them somewhere. So these are the Quick Saver books. Wow, and there's lots of stamps. So cool, that is so cool. I wonder why the person didn't spend them. Wasn't it if you like uh, took in so many, then you get like free dishes or free cookware. And they have many pages full. That is so neat. Um, I'm just looking to see if there was like a date on it, but I don't, I don't see one. But there is instructions for redemption on there. And then, she, oh, she got me about caps. Sweet. So, love the milk caps. And I got to open up to see what else is in there. This is fun stuff. It is so much fun. You got the milk caps and then you got... Oh, are there more stamps? Love it. Love it. All these things aren't gonna go through my head. It's like you're doing a video, girl. If you keep talking, you can think about think about it later. And then these wonderful milk caps. I just picked up some from Joanne's with the Tim Holtz. I just got a pack and um I'm seeing all these great videos of these crafters making things with like uh, the altered um, 
playing card, the ATC cards, the guest checks, and I'm seeing more and more of the milk caps on there. And these are like in really good shape. Those are so neat. So I did get a pack of the Tim Holtz ones. I just haven't um, used them yet. Uh, need to do that. All right, let me set these aside. I don't want anything to happen to them. To them, I'll set them up here. And then there's non-alcoholic cherry cider label. And this flower label. And then the coupon book, the ice coupon book. Sweet, sweet. First of all, it has this notch right there. And it has the coupons in there. Oh my goodness, you did not have to send me this. I love these though. They're so stinking cute. It goes for the coupon. But I'm glad you did send me them because I love them. Absolutely love them. Thank you so much, Amelia. Love it. And there's, of course, more. There's more in this box. Vintage papers. <laughs> mm. Mm. Make me all excited. These great coupon receipts. I feel like I should have gloves on or something handling them delicately. I do not have any of this stuff. None of it. I just like, wow, this is so cool. So I don't want to mess anything up. I'm just going to try to flip through them. The receipts. Just old receipts all stapled together. Huh. Interesting. 1927. And you would think it could have been yesterday. So cool. Thank you so much. I love the, even the little, um, how you just taped them up inside this piece of cardstock. It just, it looks, it just added to the vintageness of it. Smells a little old. Oh, wow. Wow, look at these. Gorgeous. And they feel so nice in the fingers. Almost a waxed, wax paper filling. Those are nice. She took the care of putting them between some cardboard so they wouldn't get damaged. And they did not at all. And then just for fun. Purchase order. Nice. The car the copy. I'm gonna swing the camera around uh real quick. And I wanted to just flip the camera around so I can show you real quick how everything came. So she had that packaged up nice, and there's those envelopes again, gorgeous. The vintage papers, wonderful. Some of the more vintage goodies, there's the milk caps and the wax, and that one, I tell you guys. Let me see if I can get the sparkle on this side. I think it's a palm wax. Can you see that? I've never uh, had bonjour wax before, so I'm excited to try that. Trivia Pursuit cards. And then here's this wonderful book of um, stamps. Thank you card. There's the notebook. Again, close up. I think bad. When the kids was coming down the steps, so I edited some of that out. Even the paper's like an off-white, like an eggshell. Okay, 
Here's the bags. Love in the seed packets. I really didn't give a close up of those. But these are at Target right now. And this one has the window. There's the gray color and then the craft color that I know of. The trinket uh, jewelry holder, which I really need that. You can use that. I don't own one. And then the uh, bridge set. So thank you again. Oops, I'm going to move this stuff over so I don't lose it. Thank you so much, Amelia. I absolutely love everything. Thank you for thinking about me and spoiling me. Um, I don't know how I'm going to top this one. But thank you again. Thanks for joining me, everyone. Take care. Bye.